Hey everyone, it's me. Today is my weigh-in day, so let's get right to it. Last week I weighed in at 183, and this week I weighed in at 181. So, that was a loss of 2 pounds. Very excited. I'm 2 pounds away from being 179. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so, um, since August of 09, when me and my best friend started the whole uh, plan together, I've lost 41 pounds, and since March, when I started, like, my plan type thing, um, I call it my plan, I don't know why, I just, uh, I don't know, but since I started that in March, I've lost 19 pounds, so almost 20 pounds in, like, two months, so, yeah. oh my gosh, that's a lot, and it's crazy because, like, I don't really feel like I've lost that much. In that short amount of time, it's very odd. It's an odd feeling. So, yeah. Also, today is my ninth month being on the um, plan since August. And I did do my measurements, so I will tell you guys what um, I've lost in inches and stuff. Um, the last time I did do measurements was last month. I haven't done it for a long time. Since, like, last year, probably December or something. Um, but... Since um, last month, I will tell you guys how many inches I've lost. So, my chest is 38 when I've lost an inch since last month. Um, my waist is 34 and I've lost 1.5 inches. Hips, 40 and I've lost 1.5. Um, thighs, 22. It's really hard to do the thighs because I don't know. I'm doing it in the middle, kind of, and I'm not sure if I should do, like, the upper or lower thigh, I don't know, so I do the middle, so it's 22, and I've lost an inch since last month, calf 16, so I've lost 0.5, and ankles 9.2 inches, and I've lost 0.3, so yeah, I'm very excited, um, I wanted to, like, look back from, since I did it in December or so, but I haven't done that yet, I don't know where my calendars are, so when I do that, I'll tell you guys, um, that, because I'm really interested to, like, figure out what I was in the beginning when I first started this, and, uh, what I am now, so, yeah. Okay, how did this week go? Um, last week was really good, and I only had one day of fast food, and that was Panda Express, and I did really good at Panda Express, so, yeah, very, very excited. Yay! Challenge week 11. I basically said the same things from last week, except for I put down don't eat as much sweets and sodium, um, because I think I've been having a lot of sodium, and I need to stay away from sodium as much as possible. So, I don't know if you can see this or not. Again, I'll take a picture and post it at the end of the video. But, yeah, my week was really good. And I stayed below the yellow line. Yay! And I really, really stayed below um, 500 when I went to bed. And, yeah, because, just because, like, those days I kind of ate a lot. Well, not a lot, a lot. I think what killed me was the snacks. Um, it was my dad's birthday on Friday, and Mother's Day, of course, was yesterday. So, um, I had a lot of, like, cake, cakey stuff and icing and stuff. So, um, yeah, I worked all that off. Okay, also this week, I filmed the video on Wednesday, and I came to some realizations and things I've noticed about myself, so I will post it right here. Realization number one is that if it really wasn't for my mom, I would still be 140 pounds or probably heavier, because seriously, I had no motivation whatsoever and I didn't really have the desire to lose weight, and I didn't think that I needed to lose weight, I guess. I I don't know. It was odd. Like, I don't really remember. And since, like, she does jazzercise, and when she was in school, she took nutrition classes and stuff, so she's helped me a lot, like, to learn what to eat and what not to eat, and all the exercise and stuff that I've been doing. She's just helped me a lot, and I can't thank her enough for what she's done for me. Seriously, if it wasn't for her push, I would not be where I am right now. And I'd probably be un very unhappy. And I wish I would have listened to my mom because she wanted it for me and I didn't want it for myself when I was 14. And I wish that I really wanted it for myself 
back then because I would have been so much happier with myself and I wouldn't be where I am right now talking to you guys. So I think that it's a sign that I am put here for a reason and maybe it's to help other people and give them that push because seriously, like if I'm doing this right now and losing this weight, you right now who's watching it can. If like seriously, I it blows my mind. Like when I look at myself in the mirror, I'm just like I am not 183 right now. Are you kidding me? Like it hasn't really sunk in yet. Like it's crazy. And seriously, if I can do it and I had no motivation in the beginning and I had no desire to do anything and just that push that like that person saying that I want it for you and I want you to be happy. I want to do that to people who need that push because like I wish that I would have listened to my mom when I was that heavy. So yeah, I, I'm going to get emotional now and I don't want to start crying on you guys. So yeah. Um, anyways, happy news. Here we go. Okay, uh, yeah, I noticed that I still have, like, skin, you know, hanging down, but I notice I'm having, like, some muscle here, you know what I'm saying? Like, I can flex my muscle, and I have something there now, and it's crazy, and, like, if I suck in my stomach, I can almost freaking see my ribs, like, it's intense. Like, I was, like, feeling, I was, like, dude, I showed my mom, I was, like, look it, I can, like, see my ribs now. And I, I, of course, I have collarbones, and I've had, I've had those for a while now, but I mean, like, it's crazy. And, like, my shoulder blade, I can see my shoulder blade when I, of course, when you move it the right way. And I can kind of see my spine now. It's crazy. Like, I'm like, dude, this is intense. Also, a realization number two, I forgot to film, I just came to this realization today, is that, um, according to my grandma and my cousin, they can really tell that my self-confidence has went up and I'm a lot more talkative kind of than I was before and they said I've changed a lot within the last year and I don't really notice it myself but I guess like looking back like the very first weigh-in video I did I was really really slow and not talking very fast and wasn't really had much energy really and like now I'm just like talk and talk 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 I guess and it's weird for me but I love that because now I can tell that when it, since I'm losing that weight I am being more like outgoing kind of and talkative social so yeah I thought that was really cool something awesome happened on uh what day was that I don't know what day it was but here's the video from it I have kept these pants these jeans since I was in seventh grade and they're my favorite pair of jeans ever and um, I actually tried them on last year sometime but I recorded a video and since I had to like reboot my computer all the way to day one that video is gone so um, when I did try them on last year I I could get them on my legs but they were super tight and I could not button them whatsoever so I can actually fit them now. It's freaking amazing. I'm so happy right now. Okay, here they are. Look at, look at the, oh, they're like beads. I love these so much. And they have the beads right here, too. I don't know if you can see that, but yeah. They fit. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. So awesome. And I'm hoping tomorrow I get to um, try on some new jeans and see, like, what size I am now. Because the jeans I have on are 12, and I got these when I lost the 20 pounds, uh, which was like December or something. So I need new jeans. And yeah, I really want to know what size I am, because these are Lee jeans, and I'm wearing a 12 right now. And the ones, the Joe Boxer ones that I showed you, there are 15s. And I hate how, like, jeans are different sizes. I hope you guys are all having an awesome week so far, and I guess I'll talk to you guys all later. Bye.